was early on a recent drive across America. 3,000 miles, four time zones, 13 states, and a lifetime of memories. My two children and I are in Chicago staying with loved ones. It's the morning after an annual Christmas party, and the hostess with the mostess was busy cleaning away the prior evening's fun. I'm helping this fabulous cook with the process when she slides a handwritten card within my view. Written by her husband's aunt, the note thanked Mary Gann Schmidt for all she is as a loving and supportive spouse to Victor and a devoted and responsible mother to two darling children, Shannon and Nolan. Aunt Dolly, who wrote the letter, and her sister Kay, Mary's mother-in-law, are Kilgallen family members. This family, a half century ago, started Cousins Christmas. It's a warm family gathering where Santa Claus, or one of his assistants, makes a surprise appearance with gifts for the younger children present. A few years ago, I had the honor of serving as Santa and wrote about the experience in Lemons and the Margaritas. Anyway, the cleaning and conversation were going well when Mary shared this loving note. I found my reading glasses and read the short message. It warmed my marrow. Aunt Dolly had taken the time to express thanks the family's hopes and prayers have been realized when Victor, exercising patience and intelligence, found the right girl in waiting to marry, Mary. Whenever I get the privilege of giving a pep talk to a group, we talk a lot about teamwork being the key to success. Much time is spent discussing the value of working well with others for the betterment of our families, workplaces, and communities. Three things about this handwritten note really resonate when speaking of teamwork, gratefulness, appreciation and acknowledgement. Aunt Dolly went out of her way to express gratefulness and appreciation to Mary for a job well done. This week I encourage you to do the same. It might be your spouse, significant other, co-worker, child, neighbor, sibling, or complete stranger. It doesn't matter. What does matter is we never lose our sense of gratefulness and appreciation for a job well done. Write it down and give it away, okay? You never know when that sincere acknowledgement might inspire the recipient or even you to carry on in ways that honor, nurture, and add value to self and the communities we serve. We are here to encourage, give hope and confidence to one another. Let's never grow weary of saluting a job well done. If you'd like to receive the email version of the weekly pep talk, it is real easy to do. Just go to my website, Hey, Come Back Coach, and on the home page in the upper right hand corner type in your email address it's that easy to do and while you're at the website if you order my latest book lemons and the margaritas i'm going to send you a free copy of my first book kids teach the darndest things make sure you mention you heard the offer on colorado and company all this and more on my website at heycomebackcoach.com <laughs>